So this is our controller, it's Mario. Uh, we cut him out of acrylic um, with a laser cutter. And you see he has an accelerometer inside of him. He's connected to, um, to an Arduino here. So this is an example of our utility that shows the sensor data. And you see there are basic threshold sets, so that's X, uh, there's the Z, and there's the Y. You can change the thresholds over here, and another thing you can do is change the size of a moving average filter. So we set this to 25 instead of one sample. You'll see the X value is much smoother. Problem with this though is that there's lag, so we're not actually using this for our game. So let's go over to the game. So the first thing we have to do is we have to take our RFID card uh, and we have to log into the system. So to do that, uh, we place the RFID card and that logs us in and has our high score and the total lifetime coins that we've collected while playing the game. All right, so here we go. I'm gonna start playing. And you see, I, I can move left and right by tilting Mario left and right. And then I jump with a slight flick of the wrist. And then if I get really ambitious and I wanna run, I can use this button to run which makes it much more difficult, especially with this controller. So that's why we didn't include running on the main controller. So the total lifetime coins have been updated. 